here welcome back to my channel um today i'm going to be reviewing this um silicone hand i'm sorry i didn't unbox it um with you guys but i was so excited i unboxed it as soon as i got through the door really threw all the packaging away um but basically it came in just like a little small box in a little nylon bag really with a card in it there was no instructions but luckily i've already done a re read a review on youtube excuse my nails by the way they're horrendous um so yeah so i couldn't wait to to get started um and i'll kind of show you how it works so we have the five fingers little finger ring finger middle finger index finger and the thumb and it goes up and down. You've got a little turn key there to move it up and down and to tighten it where you want it. And then it also moves from side to side. This screw here comes undone so you can actually take this platform off so you can display your nails, but I won't take that off right now. And then at the bottom here, there's another screw which makes it go like that. So I've kind of got it about there at the moment. And then I've got, oh, that's a bit too tight. And then I'll loosen this a little bit, loosen that a little bit, and then you can kind of move it as you want it. So it's very flexible. And then this bit, is a suction cup, you need to wet it first and then lift this, press this button and lift this lever and it comes off and there's a little tab at the back to release the suction. Um, it's really stiff and I hurt my finger kind of taking it off earlier so I'm not gonna take it off again today. But I have attached it to a glass top um, and I need to buy a new one, this is my kitchen top. Um, also, you can make the hand from one side left to right, so you can just turn it over and then turn your fingers round accordingly, which I think is a brilliant idea. These are a little bit stiff. I find that these fingers are really close together. I think it's going to take a bit of getting used to. But anyway, so I'm going to turn them all around. There we go. And then the fingers are all attached to a spring and they have an internal thread but I'm not entirely sure what that's for. I presume it's to keep them on and you don't pull them off but they certainly don't screw on in any sense. Um, but yeah, they're really quite close together. But anyway, I'll get used to it. And the little, it comes with nail tips already on and then there's a little bag of some more but I'm not even sure where that is, to be honest. I think it might be downstairs. And literally, they have in here, if I can pull one out, it's really stiff, just bog standard tips. And this one is a size one, and the little one is a size eight. Um, and that just fits in under, uh, again, they're quite stiff to put in, but I suppose that'll give once you've used it a little bit, so. So this is my new friend and we've named her Angelina. No, we haven't. We've called her Handelina Jolie. And this is my old friend, Handria. What a difference. Handria was brilliant when you're first starting out. Um, but Handria's thumb falls off. The, the tips don't stay on. You have to have the nail trainer tips I couldn't get the cheap ones off um, eBay to work so I had to order more from Essential Nails and I think they were about £20 for a set and with some tips nail tips as well so it is quite expensive I know this hand is more expensive to buy it's £75 whereas this one I think is about 50 so maybe this is a better option because you can put your nails straight in and then you can put your tips on the top I'll show you um, so if you were going to put a tip you would size it up the same that you do with your others and then you would stick your nail tip 
to your handelina, like that, like so. I don't know if you can see that. So super excited to have a go on this. Um, I'll be having a go when I've got some time. I had some other mail, nail mail today. I had, if you remember, I did a pink set um, at the weekend, a, a pink nail set. And I was after magenta and CJP didn't have any. So I ordered Flamingo, which is this lovely bright pink colour. And then I also ordered Barbie Girl. And what did I say? That they would be almost the same. And they are almost the same. And they're almost the same to the one that I already had. So now I have three pots of bright pink. I'm wondering if CJP will let me send one back. Well, we'll see. I'll email and see. And then I also got Apple Shine, which I've been waiting for for a long time. I wanted that ages ago and kept forgetting to buy it. And I also ordered my Liz Guild um, brush, which is, uh, people have said it's about a size 12. So I need to um, get that ready for use. So I'm all ready to go on my new products. But it's been a long day, so I'm going to go and have a nice chilled glass of wine now. I've been working hard all day. And then um, I'm off next week. I'm on leave next week. So I will do lots more videos, hopefully. I am planning on doing my dining room floor, but that probably won't get done. And I'll spend most of my time playing with Handelina. How gorgeous is she? She's beautiful. Okay, now, friends, have a good evening and I will speak to you soon. Take care. Bye.